For more videos visit for the sake of education.com. Alright guys, a uh, particle is moving along a straight line such that its position is defined by S is equal to D squared minus 6D plus 5. Find the average velocity, average speed, and the acceleration of the particle when t is equal to 6 seconds. So the first thing we got to do is find an equation for the velocity. d is equal to the derivative of the position with respect to time, ds dt. So when you derivate this, you get that this is equal to 2t minus 6. So when s is equal to 0, you basically plug in the zero for the t and you get that the position is five. And when s is equal to six, you get that six squared minus six times six is zero. And again, this is five. So from, it, it didn't really move any position from zero to six, which means that the average velocity is gonna be starting position finishing position divided by the the amount of uh, seconds it doesn't really matter let's say it's six it comes out to be zero meters per second if that's important now You need to find to to be able to find the average speed. You need to find how much it really displaced. That's why we found the equation for the velocity. So when does this equal to zero? This is equal to zero when t is equal to three, which means that from zero it turned at three, and then it finished at six. We already know that the position at zero and at six is five for both of them, but what's the position at three? At three, the position is negative four. So the particle went from five to negative four and back to five. From five to negative four, it moved nine spots. And from negative four back to five, it moved another nine spots. When you add them together, you realize that this particle moved 18 meters in a matter of six seconds. If you move 18 meters in a matter of six seconds, you know that the average speed is equal to 3 meters per second. Another I want you to find the acceleration when t is equal to 6. You already have the velocity. If the velocity is 2t minus 6, you know that the acceleration is the derivative of the velocity with respect to time, which comes out to be 2 meters per second squared. So at all times, the acceleration is two meters per second squared. So A when T is equal to six is two meters per second squared. Final answer for the acceleration. Final answer for the average speed and final answer for the velocity. Please comment below if you want me to do any problems and I'll be happy to help. Thank you.